Hello everyone and welcome back to Mars Horizon where I'm playing as Japan. Sorry for the delay in bringing you episode 3 of the series, but I got sidetracked by many things. First of all, building a certain station for Kerbal Space Program, which was very intricate. And also the release of Cyberpunk 2077, which mercifully, I don't have many bugs in. So I was playing that. So apologies, I did get sidetracked. But uh, we did send a mission to the moon in this game, which I had not done before. So Lunar Orbit, we are number one. And, but I'm not playing in the hardest mode, so I'm in this sort of a medium level situation. Crude moon landing is another possibility. Uh, but let's take a look. Uh, I don't think we have... Do we have requests? We have no requests for the moon. Nobody wants a moon satellite. We do have requests here. Orbital radio. Well, I mean, we can knock some of that out. It'll give us some science. Orbital radio is a thing that happened. So, uh, select payload. Is this, is Osumi good enough? This has improved communication, but the payload reliability is horrible. Um, more power, increased build cost. Well, we do want a good return. I guess this is good enough for the orbital radio thing. Alright, so that'll complete in two months. And let us take a look at our research. We're uh, researching Eden, which will be able to bring animals into orbit. And we'll just proceed with that. We are pretty good as far as being ahead of uh, other people, but who knows? You never know. And yep, this is where we are in the tech tree. So I'm just going to go to next month. Um, NASA belittles or lunar orbit success. How dare they? Uh, after receiving a great deal of ne negative press, Na NASA would never have done this, by the way, but uh, for falling behind in the space race, NASA has responded by saying that your agency's recent lunar orbit mission was of little importance. Man, I'm going to criticize NASA. No way. Yeah. NASA's way behind anyway. We don't need their help. So, okay. Um... Research has an exclamation mark now. We've got Eden, and so I'm going to proceed with human in space. I'm not going to let them get ahead on that. Who knows, they might be quietly trying to do that. And the moon has an exclamation mark. There's a request, lunar radiation mission, huh? Okay. Uh, but, uh, well, we're planning this uh, lunar, uh, sorry, orbital radio thing. So that's fine. And yeah, let me take a look at a uh, person in human in space. Um, looks like nobody's researched that mission yet, so that's good. Animal in space, though. Uh, we really need to plan this, but we can't plan it because we're planning uh, orbital radio. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> Maybe I should have just uh, waited until I could plan this one. But nobody's working. Uh, mission not researched. Yeah, so we're the only one who's researched the mission. All right, well, we'll see. Okay. Uh, so we've got more science reward, less vehicle build cost. Or, oh, no, that's increased vehicle build cost. So that's a downside. So we're going to have to... Build a bigger vehicle. 25 kilogram payload though, it shouldn't be that big a deal. Um, this can do 25. Lambda 4S. 32% launch reliability with Lambda 4S. This able stage is overkill. And would take too long to build. So. Let's select the Lambda 4S and the booster. Well, we would just go with Lambda 4S all the way, I guess. Two months build time. Okay. Next month. Open Skies Debate. A global symposium is taking place to establish laws regarding territorial space for orbiting satellites. 
The proposed treaty states all nations should have free access to space. Would it not pass if we oppose it? And what exactly would that do? Could we like carve up the... I don't think that's going to happen. We might as well be the good guys here. Uh, improve diplomatic relations. Yeah, that's fine. Human and space research complete. So let's continue with more research. We're going to need to have astronaut training. But we can't do that yet because why? Uh, well, I guess we don't have mission control yet. Well, let's build mission control. And then we'll have astronaut training. Okay. All right. Uh, next month. UFO fever, the discovery of debris likely belonging to a weather balloon has sparked a wave of conspiracy theories surrounding UFOs. Several questionable magazines have approached your agency for comment. While your researchers urge dismissing such stories, your PR team has noted the potential for drumming up interest in space exploration. Hmm, it's devious. It's very devious. Uh... I mean, will it hurt our science? I think it would hurt our science. I, I'm gonna dismiss the speculation. I mean, it's not gonna stop them from speculating anyway. But maybe it'll help our science. If we're not make it encouraging people to think silly. 10% um, launch reliability increase. Payload reliability went down. That's not great. I don't like when that happens. Okay, training. We can do some training, potentially. It'll depend on when the launch date is. Um, we can launch... Yeah, I mean... 81% there, but then we risk getting into the winter here. We're going to have to... I, I don't know if we can research another one while we're pending a launch. I don't think so. So let's let's try and keep this quick. It's an extra mission anyway. ESA completed artificial satellite, fifth to do so. And what's this American mission here? Soviet Union completed artificial satellite after China? <laughs> anyway, animal in space though. We better get on that. But yeah, we're looking perhaps too good. I I don't know if there's any way in the middle. I don't think there's any way in the middle of it to change the difficulty. Uh, I feel a little bit guilty about not having a higher difficulty now. But we'll get to see all the things. Okay. A little launch mission. Could fail miserably, could be successful, let's see. A little Lambda 4S. Nakama. Oh, uh, very nice launch reliability now. Don't need to reschedule, good conditions, continue. Okay, off it goes. Wobbly cam. Okay, well, safe, but not wonderful. Got increased reliability of it. Okay, orbital radio. Comms and data. Bonus for that. Uh, we've got three turns. Well, if we get da one data, we can get two comms out of it like that. So let's start with that. 
but we'll get a bonus data, a uh, bonus comms like that. Let's try that. Ooh, just barely. Okay, data collected. Ah, oh, fail on the comms. Um, resist. Sure. Don't know if that's optimal. I'm gonna turn one the one data into two comms, and then one power, one comms into three data. Let's see if that works. Could be rough. Okay, that's good. Ooh, extra. Additional comms. Excellent. And that worked too. Atmospheric sampling. So we're doing pretty well. And what we need is a little bit more power. And then one more comm will do the trick. Let's see if we can manage that. Oh, not quite. Uh, oh, it worked. Did it work? It worked. It just barely. Well, really, just barely. Couldn't even tell. All right. Okay, we got some bonus mission rewards. Okay, I completed orbital radio. All right. How's our research doing? Mission control. It'll take some time. So, I want to do animal in space. Animal in space. Plan mission. Payload. Eden. Yes. And build payload. Mission control research complete. So, next. We can do Astronaut Training Facility. Okay, and let's build Mission Control. Yes, build. That's positive with that facility. It looks like it'd be good to have it line up with uh, anything else. No, nope, nothing else cares really. So this will be fine. All right. Eden is complete. I don't know why it's called Eden, but we've our vehicle is gonna cost more, but the science reward is good. I really need to save the designs, um, but no, it's fine. It's fine. Uh, oh, let's go back and do the upper stage first. And so that's a scout upper stage, and it can carry, surprisingly, the the load, even though the able upper stage can't. That is not typical, and so Scout Al Gol, basically a scout rocket, using a scout rocket to launch an animal into space, definitely was not done, but Otsukare will be our rocket, fine. I'm interested to see all the names that they have available. Uh, so, 56% launch reliability, I feel like, what is this 2 Delta? Oh, uh, supplementary boosters we can research, but we don't need that. We can put a Delta, and then that's a little bit better launch reliability. Lambda 4S obviously wouldn't work, but this could do it. The Delta rocket could do it, but it's only a minor addition to the launch reliability. Uh, we could probably just do training to make up that. quite a cost to add the Delta one.
Okay, funding review time. They should be happy. Yeah, very happy. Almost uh, level 5. Okay. Alright. So, Oscar is being built. Nothing else I need to take a look at. Astronaut training facility, research complete. And, ooh, a Hall of Fame building. Uh, so, spacecraft assembly will be necessary for more complicated payloads, but they haven't asked for it yet. So we could wait. Mission control expansion will allow more missions. A me medium launch pad will eventually need, so let's go with that. Pretty sure that's gonna come up soon. We also need payload mercury, though. Let's do our our animal in space mission first. You know, I mean, we won't want to dis design the crew pod before and hire ast. Well, we should hire astronauts before trying to uh, without building the crew pod necessarily. That's okay. But anyway, astronaut facility. It looks like it likes being next to mission control and it likes being next to whatever that is. I don't know what that is. Um, let's just have it next to mission control, I think. Near the beach where we know astronauts like to go. Um, anything better? Minus 2% uh, vehicle cost. I'd rather have the launch reliability. Well, that's expensive to place building like that, though, because of those rocks. Um, here's cheaper. Yeah. We'll probably have to rearrange things sometime. Okay. Next month. Signal received. A group of children on the opposite side of the world have managed to pick up radio signals from your recent orbiting satellite as part of a school project. The story has been widely covered in the press. Um, sure, send mission memorabilia. Mission control complete. And we have an extra mission slot. That's good. Okay, plus 10% launch reliability, minus 10% payload reliability. I like my animals to be in the safe payload. Uh, we will train. We will train. And the launch date, we'll set to June to increase the impact of our training. We can put it off till October. I will not be responsible for animal demise if I can help it. Yo, oh, let's get the lunar radiation. I mean, we're the only ones that can do that, right? Nope, nope, they've all made lunar orbit now. Well, not all, but, uh, boy, the Soviets are... <laughs> this is obviously totally wrong, but, um, yep. Yeah, yep, yeah, I don't know how that's worked. We, bet we better keep at it. I mean, it's for the sake of, uh, capitalist societies everywhere. Or, <laughs> anyway, uh, crude moon landing, no. Request lunar radiation or moon micrometeorites. This is challenging. This is medium risk. We'll go with, I mean, it's they're only giving us a tiny little bit of extra science to take an ambitious challenging mission, but this is a 900 science reward for a medium risk mission. I mean, I think it's okay. And radiation is important. Heat 10 is our go-to for this. I want as reliable a thingamajig as possible. Okay, let's build it. I like being able to do two missions at the same time. Okay. Power cut. A local power outage during the construction of the Heat 10 payload for your upcoming lunar radiation mission has resulted in minor damage to one of its components. Your engineers have estimated a 5% reduction in payload reliability, which is currently 75%. Cost of 100,000. I mean, we should replace the payload. Uh, replace the... I mean, it, it's... it's math, I think the math works out that I probably shouldn't. 
I'm pretty sure that I shouldn't replace the component, but I will. <laughs> uh, anyway. A 5% chance... A 5% reduction in reliability. You just take that 5% out of the cost of the... Of potentially rerunning the mission, and it's not going to end up being 100,000, so... So in terms of cost-benefit analysis, we should not have paid the 100,000, but I did anyway. Take that, economists. No. <laughs> All right, Heaton, our engineers are uncertain about the launch configuration's performance, yet have emphasized the invaluable data that will be gained from uh, gained on the vehicle. Vehicle parts gain two experience levels after launch. Launch reliability is reduced. We really need a nice launch vehicle. Yeah, it looks like it's the able stage. Yeah. Algol? No, I want the Delta rocket, right? Um, Algol can actually lift the able stage to the moon? Oh, right, because it always says moon regardless of what's actually lifting it. That's 67% launch reliability, this is 72% launch reliability. It's probably not worthwhile using the Delta rocket. I'll take the Algol, even though it's weird. Shirin Yoku, I don't even know. I understood some of the others, but this one I don't get. Okay, we'll build that. It's an extra mission anyway. Animal in space, how's that going? One month until launch. Okay. Another payload component issue? Manufacturing error in Heat 10 payload. Oh, this is worse. I should have just paid for this one instead of the other one. Now I feel like... I'll leave the component, but this is worse. Yeah, definitely should have done the 5% one. Okay, well, let's try it. It's a nice launch site. Very beautiful. Adequate conditions. Well... 73% is 73%. This... Was, did that look like a good launch to you? I don't know. Nice skies, actually. Just the right clouds. I don't know. It seems like very nice conditions to me. Mm, safe. Secure launch. Okay. Animal in space. That was the other one that was launching. <laughs> I missed. I, make, I mixed up which one was launching actually in my mind. Um. All right. We're gonna make sure we get a signal first. And then we are going to get lots and lots of data from that signal, hopefully. Oh, we didn't get the signal, so that fails the whole deal. Well, let's resist, otherwise we're not going to get the data. Uh, data. Okay. Whew. All right. Except, all right. So we got the data. It's very important. Let's uh, secure a com, and we'll do another com. Oh, we can't do that. We don't have enough power. Shoot. Not thinking straight. How does it handle that? Well, it failed. Can't resist. I don't. I didn't. I don't even know why it allowed us to do it in the first place. 
Okay, we got the requirements though. Let's recharge, recharge this turn. Okay. So... I don't think we can actually go for the bonus reward. I've messed up. I don't want to sacrifice the possibility of having a successful mission at this point, so we're just going to go like that. Well, that didn't work. Oh, we don't have enough to resist. Alright, but it was successful. They didn't even show the animal. <laughs> That's sort of sad. Did we bring the animal back? Like a hero achievement unlocked. Okay. 